So Boogie2988 has been getting absolutely flamed over the last couple weeks because his girlfriend reveal turned out to be a lot creepier than it probably should have been. So let's get right into the story. So if you don't know, Boogie2988 has been a big YouTuber over the last couple years. I'm sure most of you know who he is. And over on his Twitter, he's been hyping up this girlfriend reveal. Apparently, you know, he got a girlfriend. Sorry, ladies, she's not available on the market anymore. Stop sliding in Boogie. 2988's DMs, okay, ladies? But yeah, he revealed that he got a girlfriend and he's been hyping up a reveal on what she looks like, maybe being in a video. You know, honestly, it, in a kind of weird way, I mean, this is one of his tweets. He put like a little box over his head, over his girlfriend's head, and said, Retweet if you want to meet my new girlfriend in a video soon. Like, what is this, a fucking Smash reveal? Like a Smash character reveal? Honestly, and then they did this willingly, you know, because he wanted to show his new girlfriend girlfriend thing now obviously i understand the approach you know he's trying to get a little bit of internet clout you know some impressions on twitter that kind of thing however believe it or not boogie 2988 is a 50 year old man pretty much i think he's 49 turning 50 this year if i'm not mistaken so this is a 50 year old man doing a girlfriend reveal on twitter.com or should i say x.com sorry about that so already the reveal was a little weird and then finally he actually posted the reveal of his girlfriend and here's the picture now honestly if boogie didn't caption this as being his girlfriend i would have thought this was his dog now can you guess how old this girl is now don't get me wrong this isn't a boogie 445 situation she's not underage thank goodness but she does look underage i mean this could be like a high school level girl and at the time she's 20 years old this is boogie's 20 year old girlfriend boogie keep in mind is 50 years old that is a 30 year age gap now honestly i want to say that this is boogie's midlife crisis however somehow it seems like this is actually the girl's midlife crisis somehow unfortunately because only 18 percent of the people watching this video right now are actually subscribed to the channel don't be part of the 81 percent subscribe to the channel you have nothing to lose and regardless of boogie being boogie and being himself you know big youtuber guy this girl willingly became partners with a person who is 30 years older than him so obviously there's something wrong there i mean this is not a normal condition now obviously i think age gaps in dating are, are mildly normal you know especially as you get older it becomes a little more common you know maybe a couple years i think for me the most would be like three maybe four years max but like 30 years is fucking crazy i mean honestly what the hell did these guys even talk about there's such a major gap in between 30 years and i think the thing that really gives off that this girl has some problems is that you know don't get me wrong i'm sure boogie has still some clout and has some reputation you know towards his name but you know what she's obviously not with him for the money because boogie doesn't have that kind of money you know he hasn't been a super big youtuber in years and years so the only real reason that this girl could be with boogie is for you know probably because she has some problems like boogie they probably connected over that and somehow you know this something tells me this isn't gonna make it better for her one of the replies to boogie's reveal tweet said skipped right over that age question huh and boogie replied she's 20 i know people will judge but look at me man i'm fat and ugly and when an adult woman says let's give it a shot i probably should be willing to hear her out regardless of age as long as she's an adult now i kind of see boogie's point i mean at that age you know he's he willingly calls himself fat and ugly you know i'm not calling him that youtube don't take my video down but you know what he, he makes a point you know the dating age for not only 50 year old men but also men that are 50 that look like boogie isn't crazy high so i can understand you know wanting to be with someone you know regardless but this is just it's gonna sp uh, it's spelling disaster it's like a car accident you can't look away from this is going to turn out bad for boogie i give this relationship maybe six to eight months before there's some reveal on twitter you know my experience with boogie 2988 that comes out with some big controversy or something weird along those lines and someone actually replied it's worse that you said you've been texting her back and forth talking through your trauma like what what age was she when you first started dming 18 at the end of the day she's an adult though so let's keep it between you two and boogie replied she was 19 almost 21 now so keep in mind that boogie 2988 when he was 48 years old he started chatting with a 19 year old i mean obviously you know it's legal the 
they're both quote unquote adults and so I don't have a problem with the legality however I still think this is just weird and messed up you know I, and like I said in the beginning of the video obviously they connected through trauma so she probably has some problems unfortunately and that's the only reason she's with you know someone 30 years older than her but something tells me that even though there's someone that you guys can talk about your trauma with you know something tells me this isn't going to make it any better if anything this is probably going to add to the trauma i mean think about the future implications you know in 10 years down the line you know these people are very likely you know boogie and his 20 year old girlfriend are probably not going to be together and when you know people want and when this girl wants to start dating like guys around her same age or something what are the chances that these guys are going to be like oh hey let me google you and then boom there's a picture of you with a 50 year old man i mean how's that gonna look i mean for a lot of people i think that would be a major turn off and then boogie finally settled it with this one tweet pretty much saying my one and only tweet about age she's an adult she's 20 i'm older but look at me man i'm fat old and ugly as a sin when an adult woman i get along with with wants to give it a shot i'm going to do the smart thing and give it a shot if you can't handle this tell your therapist now i gotta say boogie this definitely doesn't sound like the thing you should be telling other people i mean to be honest you should be talking to a therapist and this girl should be talking to a therapist about your guys's trauma okay you shouldn't be connecting about each other's trauma together when there's a 30 year old age gap this is just not going to end well <laughs> and then he gave it a couple days and tweeted out is this better or is this creepier <laughs> you know what i gotta say it's a little creepier like this is not this is not the actions of a reasonable you know 20 year old girl okay this is not a normal thing to do you know to start dating somewhere 30 30 years older and you know what i guess you know i see the point you know mills could be a good a good thing but this is not the same i mean maybe like a fling or something but like having a full-on relationship with thir someone 30 years older than you it's just it's i don't know it feels wrong it's it's kind of creepy now again he is you know it's legal so they're both quote-unquote consenting adults so they can do what they want but it's still like weird to me and then wings redemption actually just tweeted out you know i haven't heard from wings redemption in a while but he actually tweeted out about the situation saying tried to set up a podcast meeting with boogie 2988 couldn't make it he had to pick up his girl <laughs> from school <laughs> <laughs> and I definitely think if this was anyone more relevant, like don't get me wrong, I knew Boogie used to be really relevant back in like 2010, but if this was someone like a big YouTuber now, if this was like I Show Speed or or like like a real famous person, you know, say like any Hollywood celebrity or something, I think a lot more people would be talking about this. Like if you guys don't know, Leonardo DiCaprio constantly gets talked about because his girlfriends never go over the age of 25, and people constantly make fun of this, but no one's talking about this boogie situation for some reason and i gotta say seeing this almost normalized you know this major age gap for youtubers is always concerning to me i mean i think initially this started happening with like keemstar i remember keemstar came out and he was said he was dating like a couple 20 year olds and so that was kind of weird but now boogie's doing it and i don't know this situation just kind of creeps me. i think you know i i understand boogie wants you know this internet quote and the, the farm impressions but i think this would have been better off for for him and his girlfriend if this is quote unquote you know a serious relationship and not just some like internet clout thing to just keep it completely off the internet because honestly who asked and who wants to know <laughs> But that's just my thoughts on this situation. You can tell me your thoughts down in the comments. In our last video, we talked about how XQC was getting completely smashed on Twitter. He's getting canceled on Twitter for uploading a two hour long react video where he does pretty much says nothing in it. It gets even crazier when ordinary gamer starts roasting him on Twitter to tens of millions of people. This is a video you're not gonna wanna miss. Click here to watch it now.